Let's try this again. Hi, everyone. Hello. Hello? Is the microphone on chat? Just doing a little pre show. Warm up. Hey, Madao, here's me. Madao, here's me. I wish I could figure out how to make this go away. Oh, it went away. Oh, it's back. It's like pops in and out. I don't like it. Let me make some coffee. Do you hear my pop in? Says hello. If he is, tell him I'm, I'm making coffee, okay? I'll bring Annie in too to say hi.
Chat, what do you guys think? Lights on or lights off? Lights on? Oh. Here's lights on. The problem is the, the lights behind me. So it's doing a pretty bad shadow. I put a, a jellyfish towel up on the window to block some light, but it's not enough. Lights off, chat says. Alright. Morning, Jan. How's it going? Ooh. I mean, you know what? There's a lamp over here. A little. the screen right now. No more vision problems. Jan, I'm having trouble hearing you. I'm going to turn you up on my end. Party audio up. Chat, how is, uh, how does it sound? I'm talking for Jan. What headphones are those? They glow. I don't, I don't know. They're from a big box in the office. So we're going to get started officially in a few minutes here. But uh, in the meantime... <clears throat> Last updated, April 1st, 2018. Please read this agreement carefully. By accessing or using our games or services, you agree to be bound by all terms described herein and all terms incorporated by reference. If you do not agree to all of these terms, do not access or use our games or services. This agreement contains, among other things, an arbitration. I just want to make sure that um, we have to read the whole thing, all 40 pages of it, and I just want to be on like have recorded video evidence that I'm reading the EULA. Cool. Uh, this agreement contains, among other things, an arbitration which provision section 19A and a class action waiver section 19B, which do not apply if you reside outside of the United States. So it does apply to us. Uh, if you are a resident of Germany, some specific clauses apply to you, see sections 7 and Uh, Jane, I'm going to need you to, to read that. Uh, you can't just say the word. Thank you. Including without limitation any multiplayer online or downloadable portions thereof and any related written and written or electronic documentation that or content the game. 
the game is licensed and not sold, and this agreement confers no title or ownership to the game or any copy thereof. This agreement does not alter in any way with the terms or conditions of any other agreement you may have with Bandai Namco for any other products or services. Any changes, additions, or deletions by you are not acceptable and hereby expressly rejected by Bandai Namco. Additional terms provided by us, including but not limited to posted fees, billing procedures, and promotional rules may apply to particular functionalities and features. Chat cannot hear Jan. Uh-oh. We have to reread the whole thing. Hmm. Party setting. Allow your voice to be shared. Allow for current party. Prioritize party chat. Okay. Jan, say something for the fine folks at home. Still nothing. I can hear you just fine. Let me restart this broadcast really quick. Here we go one more time. Everybody's feeling fine. Here we go now. Yes, yes, here we go. Uh, let me wait for this to get out of the way. 15 for details. If you are a resident of the European Union, a specific clause applies to you. See section 10 for details. If you are a resident of Australia, a specific clause applies to you. See section 15 for details. If you are a resident of North, Central, or South America, excluding the United States, a specific clause applies to you. See section 18 for details. If you are a resident of the United States, a specific clause applies to you. See section 19 for details. The an this end user license agreement, this agreement, is a contract between you and either Bandai Namco Entertainment Incorporated, B-N-E-I, Bandai Namco Entertainment America Incorporated, B-N-E-A, or Bandai Namco Entertainment Europe, S-A-S, B-N-E-E, -E, as applicable in either case. Bandai Namco, us, we, or our, and applies to your access to and use of this game in which... This agreement appears, or posted online, this game referenced above. Okay, it's, uh, there will be a quiz at the end, so remember, BNEI, Bandai Namco Entertainment Incorporated, okay, BNEA, okay. Bandai Namco Entertainment America, and BNEE, Bandai Namco Entertainment Europe. Oh, but what does the SAS mean? Is this like going to be a trick question? Because I don't like this shit. Including without limitation any multiplayer online or downloadable portions thereof and any related written or electronic documentation or content. The game. The game is licensed and not sold, and this agreement confers no title of ownership to the game or any copy thereof. This agreement does not alter in any way the terms or conditions of any other agreement you may have with Bandai Namco for other products or services. Any changes, additions, or deletions by you are not acceptable and hereby expressly rejected by a Bandai Namco. Additional terms provided by us, including, but not limited to, posted fees, billing procedures, and promotional rules may apply to particular functionalities and features that are a part of the game. Unless otherwise indicated, any additional applicable terms are incorporated by reference to this agreement. In an event of a conflict between this agreement and any additional item terms, the additional terms shall govern with respect to such particular functionalities and features. 1. Contracting Party the Bandai Namco entity which you are entering into a contractual relationship with depends on your place of residence. If you are a resident of Asia, this agreement is between you and BNEI. If you are a resident of North, Central, or South America, this agreement is between you and BNEA. If you are a resident of anywhere else, this agreement is between you and BNEE. Privacy. Data collected through this game is held by BNEI in Japan. For additional information, please refer to BNEI's privacy policy, which will be shown after this agreement, for information about how we collect, use, and disclose such data. 3. Preconditions of the licenses. The license granted in this agreement are specifically conditioned upon the following and your compliance with all the other terms and conditions set forth in this agreement. A. 
you have reached the age of majority in your jurisdiction. If you are under the age of majority in your jurisdiction, your parent or legal guardian must agree to be bound by this agreement and by any applicable additional terms. I have to call my mom. Uh, I believe Jeff is my legal guardian. Okay. B, you agree to and comply with all of the terms of this agreement and any additional terms as may be applicable to the game. That's a little vague. C, your access and use of the game is subject to certain security measures, including without limitation, registering the game with a serial code, having continuous access to the internet, and accepting certain security slash digital rights management features. Failure to accept and fully comply with such security measures may partially or completely impair your use of the game. The, I understand legally why they have to capitalize G for game, but I'm just thinking of the wrapper. Right, your access right. and use of the wrapper is in accordance with all applicable local, state, national, and foreign laws and regulations. You access and use the game only in local matches running valid... Validly licensed. Wow, that word was hard for me. Copies of operating systems on which the game was designed to operate the hardware. So this is their like anti-piracy clause. Uh, F, okay, okay. If you are a resident of North, Central, or South America, uh, this doesn't apply to us, but people watching at home might. Uh, purchase uh, and use of items are subject to the new network t- terms of service and user agreement. This online service has been sublicensed to you by Sony Interactive. Entertainment America. S-I-E-A. Remember that one? Okay. Uh, If you are a resident of Asia, you you have accepted and are in compliance with all terms and conditions applicable to the hardware, including any terms of such platform regarding the checkout process. If you are a resident elsewhere, any content purchased in an in-game store will be purchased from Sony Interactive Entertainment Network Europe Limited S I E N E and be sub subject to PlayStation Network Entertainment Net- no uh, PlayStation Network Terms of Service and u- user agreement which is available on the PlayStation Store. Please check usage rights of each purchase as these may differ from item to item. Unless otherwise shown, content available in any in-game store has the same age rating as the game. Number 4 Limited use license. A. Subject to terms of this agreement and your compliance with these terms, we grant you a non-exclusive, non-transferable, limited license to use the game for for the term of the agreement in your country of residence on hardware that you own or exclusively control. Um, uh, Somebody in the chat pointed out you can't skip over the TMs. You have to say trademark. We don't have to redo this section, but just going forward, we got to remember trademark. Right. Right, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Uh, and solely as permitted by the applicable platform usage rules of terms of service, if any. Any updates, supplements, or replacements to the original game are governed by this agreement unless separate license ah. terms apply such update. The proceeding states an entirety of your rights with respect to the game, and we reserve all rights in and to uh, the game not expressly granted to you in this agreement without limiting the forego. Without limiting the foregoing, what does that mean? You do not or authorize or permit any third party to do. I think they're just testing us. I think this is fake. I don't... Uh, What does age of majority mean? (laughs) Any of the following. Distribute, copy, license, rent, or sell the game except as expressly permitted by this license or the applicable platform usage rules. Two. Use the game for any purpose other than your own personal non-commercial use. Wait. Isn't that what we're doing right now? We're oh, violating no. that. Oh no. We're breaking the EULA. Um, maybe there's a separate uh, agreement with Twitch's policies. We'll have to go maybe. into Twitch's EULA after this. Maybe, um, yeah. Three, maybe reverse engineer, decompile, disassemble, or attempt to discover the source code for the game. Four, modify, alter, or create any derivative works of the game, remove, alter, or obscure any copyright, trademark, or other proprietary rights noticed in, on, in, on or in the game. Six, use the game for purposes for which it is not designed. Seven, use the game on any hardware that you do not own or excessively control. Eight, circumvent or attempt to circumvent. You can't even try to circumvent any security measures in the game. Or nine, attempt to obscure or mask your region when accessing any 
online features of this game. 5. Ownership. The game and all content, other than user content as defined, defined below, and other materials in the game or available through the game, including without limitation the Bandai Namco, Namco logo and all designs, text, graphics, pictures, information, data, software, sound files, game currency, virtual items, and other files, and, and the selection of the arrangement thereof. Thereof is a word? I thought it was... The, mm. And the property of Bandai Namco or its licensors and are projected by copyright and other intellectual property laws and treaties, notwithstanding any provision by the contrary herein, you agree that you have no right or title to any content that appears in the game, including without limitation by game currency and virtual items. Six, term A, subject to your satisfaction and the preconditions set forth in section three, this agreement will remain in full first. Damn it! <laughs> it's over. <laughs> yeah. uh, just accept it! Just accept it! Hold on. Okay. What is this? This this is this is hacking into this makes it an isekai. Oh shit! Are we uh, attempting to circumvent uh, security measures? Circumvent. The oh fuck out. baby. Last oh. update, December first, twenty eighteen. This privacy policy explains how information about you is collected. No, it's okay. I accept. Uh, Deku to have all my personal information. Go beyond plus ultra with my personal info. Good morning, everyone. Uh, I'm here. Uh, I just got this. Oh. <laughs> I can't skip this either. <laughs> Uh, I don't even think chat can hear me. Um. Oh, they can't hear me. Okay, uh, so Diku's like, I'm gonna fight you. He's um, fighting, who is he fighting? Which guy is this? I haven't, I, I'm behind on the show. Oh, okay, no, I think this is a flash forward. Man, oh, he does the, Man he's doing the Manchester smash. I thought they just did smashes based on America. He's Mr. Worldwide. This is really unskippable. <laughs> this is My Hero Academia 1's Justice 2. Uh, the follow-up to One's Justice 1. I don't think it was called that, but... Uh, this is probably going to have some My Hero spoilers from, like, I don't know, I'm going to say Season 3 on. So if you're not caught up like me, you're going to get spoiled. Is this really not letting me... I can't broadcast the tutorial? <sighs> Fuck this. I was looking through all the games that I bought, and I mm -hmm. saw this one, this little game here. This is um, Giant Bomb's Game of the Year 2018 Tetris Effect. And I haven't played this since Team. Okay. Uh, and you know what? We're gonna we're gonna try and do a complete run through on Expert. Play I some believe Tetris in you, and lose ourselves. How's that sound? Oh, I'm I'm going to lose myself. For folks watching at home, uh, you can always use the ask a question feature and then Ben and I may uh, get to you on that depending on the question. I'll uh, I'll field the questions for Ben so he can be completely immersed in the zone. Please, I do not let me get out of my zone. Are you definitely in your zone? I will be. Ah, oh, shit. I can't eat meat today. What? Why? It's Catholic religion. It's, it's, it's bullshit. The Catholic day. The Catholic. It's one of the Catholic days. You can eat fish, though, right? Yeah. Yeah. Take that. Um, I'm sorry? Oh, no. Go ahead. Uh, 
Draconian Bane asks, do you think anime will be more popular as a result of social distancing? Ooh, yeah, people are definitely gonna... Like, Netflix, Crunchyroll, Giant Bomb, all sorts of oh, yeah. streaming services are gonna see a huge bump in people. So here's the thing. I actually think product productivity all around is gonna get a little boost when everyone's working from home. But it's still gonna let people like also enjoy more things like Netflix and giantbomb.com slash live. Chat. Is live is live a work you over? What's that? Is giantbomb.com slash live a, a working URL? Did I say live? I meant chat. Oh, okay, okay. I thought this was a new thing. We uh, should, I mean, we should make slash live redirect. Because I'm not going to learn the right way. Perfect. Oh. Slash but, live already does. Oh. Then I meant to say that. Uh, I think I am going to go pick up an El Gato, which is Spanish for the Gato this weekend. So um, a little more console streaming. I have an extra one. Oh yeah. I could uh I could make my way to the East Bay and drop it off at your place of residence. I'm far, man. We'll we'll talk. We'll talk. Oh, remember this game? Remember Tetris? Remember when we were happy and there was no viruses and we could all just. Oh, right, I have the thing. Oh, yeah, you have bullet time. Yeah. I need to do that. I need to build up a little more, though, because I want a Deca Tetra Tijon, or whatever it's called. Um, question from the chat from The Unseen Shadow. Uh, they ask, any chance to also stream to YouTube? So us that do actually have... Ah! Join in the fun. I hit like spin. four different buttons trying to find the right button to do this. I think it's triggers, right? Uh, yeah. Um, as of right now, we're probably at least for the rest of this week, which is uh, today. Um, oh, bad. Oh, bad. I'm not worried. You're not worried. Oh, recovery. <gasps> I'm a little more worried than I was. Um, we are looking into other options to use Restream so we can shoot no! it out. No! <coughs> places. Oh. No. Oh. Alright, that one was entirely because I... That was a button check. Yeah, that was that was data. Thank you, Jan, for putting it into terms. We are going to say, Shout out to Braun Plus! <laughs> I was saying this when I was solo streaming yesterday. Is like, I don't... We, we don't get to like, we don't get notification. It's not like when, when we get premium subscribers, it's often people, you know, coming after the fact of a live stream or something. Sure. We don't really get to like shout out people other than people who ask questions like streamers do. Right, right. What is what is your least favorite thing? And um, feel free to take your time answering this so you can focus. Uh, uh, least favorite Twitch thing? Like that is unique to streaming on Twitch culture? Uh, it's a specific one, but um, chat bots that will just chime in with really long messages about like, don't make sure to follow on these social media accounts and go to razorx.com slash ninja shroud for blah blah blah. That just like happened way too often. Um, or people abusing donation sounds. Uh, it can be funny, but 99% of the time it's not. I ever tell you about the time that I was at a party and there was a IRL Twitch streamer there? No, were they streaming? They were streaming the whole thing. Um, and uh, the dude was, like, people were having, like, kind of, like, in-depth conversations with a guy. Yeah. And I don't, and everyone had just thought that he just has, like, a weird backpack and a speaker for some reason. Because he didn't tell anyone that he was live streaming this whole fucking thing. Gross. You should be able to go to jail for that. Yeah. Um, and then the only thing that tipped people off is that people would occasionally 
subscribe to him, and then like his notification sound would pop off. If you could have a notification sound that just popped off IRL when you did certain things, what would it be? Ooh. Hmm. Man, uh, hard mode on this, I forgot, does not really fuck around. Uh, you know, I want to say the classic air horns, um, but, but I feel like it's a little too played out at this point. Um, Ben, as you know, I listen to a lot of uh, Jesus and Miro. Yes. Um, so maybe I'd have one of their uh, drops um, of them saying, you know the fucking vibes. That's good. Yeah. Oh, I love this game. It's great. I'm tempted to re-download it right now I uh have they have they added anything you know they've been doing those like they were doing weekly challenges for a while I don't know if they've added anything like substantial content wise okay we're gonna build back up for our mega baby feel the serenity. Oh, shit. Okay. I'll take a do deck of do the thing I got. Oh, wow. You, uh, did you play this in VR at all? I did. Uh, I borrowed the it was actually a really nice weekend. I knew I was going to be house sitting uh, for some friends, and so we borrowed the office VR headset because I don't have one. Um, and just like that was the weekend we just played a shit ton of uh, Tetris Effect in VR mm -hmm. and played through the entirety of the Mortal Kombat story mode. Oh wow, it's a good uh, time. Because, you know, there were, we were house-sitting a couple of elderly dogs, so we had to kind of be there the whole time and, and making sure they're okay. They're very cute. Their names are Link and Loki. They're a pair of old Boston Terriers. Adorable. They walk them around in a, in a stroller because they have trouble walking. Oh. One, one of these days I'll learn the buttons to this game. You're doing great. I can lead you home, just follow me. Even this oh, corny man. ass song is good. Wow. Oh, just take it in. I am. Uh, uh, I'm... Oh, go, go ahead. ahead. Go ahead. No, no. I was gonna ask. This sort of reminded me. Uh, I was talking with my partner about like if there's any concerts or shows in history that like if there's one concert or live performance in the history you go back in time and be a part of, what would it be? Um, okay. And their answer was Daft Punk at the Greek Theater um, with. Um, I forget who they're playing with. They're playing with somebody really fucking cool. My answer oh, was man. Talking Heads in LA, where they did the uh, Stop Making Sense filming for. Ah! Do you have any that come See, this, to mind? This is rough. I'm <laughs> like watching you. It's like it. I didn't expect it to speed up so soon. Yeah, it's, um, it's gonna it's gonna get really intense, and then it's gonna slow down a little bit, and then get even more intense, if I remember correctly. Um, I am, I definitely miss college dropout era Kanye, uh, prior to all of his oddness or 
you know, very odd choices. Yeah, sure. Um, Before so, you started, say, wearing a MAGA hat. Yeah, yeah. Um, he a real concert with a live orchestra was Weird Al last year. That was, it was it was awesome, <laughs> but I could imagine something like something nothing against the Weird Al show I saw. It was it was great, one of my favorite shows ever, actually. But like seeing something with a bit more like oomph to it, you know, right. with a live orchestra, I feel like could be really cool. I like this level a lot. I like that um, I can just watch this and I can appreciate everything going on in the background. It's like your own personal theater mode. Yeah, because I don't remember this at all. I've kind of given up on my uh, max meter or whatever it's called. Effect zone. How's chat doing? Any questions? Uh, actually, we got one from Cool Jammer Zero Zero. Uh, after this level, can Ben check the world map to see how many people are playing this game right now? Oh sure. Well, when we well, go only to if you fail out. Yeah. If. I... Yeah, it's not gonna happen. Oh. One more line. No. There we go. Oh no. I'm so close. Wow. I love Tetris. Oh. I've heard that about you. It is definitely my... Uh, I've talked about this a little bit. Uh, I think it was on the after show. Somebody called in asking what your like stress relief games are. Mm -hmm. Or anxiety relief games. And for me, uh, Tetris is great because I'm able to channel my anxiety and my compulsions into something that requires like 80% of my attention rather than like a lot of other games where I can kind of zone out. It's like Troopers are like Apex. Anything I can be really engaged helps me feel like I feel stressed. I'm stressed as fuck right now, but it's, it's a good kind of stress. It's not like a universal dread kind of stress, which it normally sure. is. Sure. Okay, that's pretty I got a lot of universal dread right now. <laughs> I saw the term global anxiety for the first time. And I was okay. Like, yeah. I could mess with that. <laughs> I got some of that. Holy shit, Ben. I don't. And someone had asked if you were a cyborg or an android because of your ability to talk and play this game. Um, and I'm just going to answer for you yes. Wow, look at that. When I had um, heart surgery, they put some other stuff in there to help me. I was like, one day I'm gonna work for video games. Can you, uh, can you upgrade me? Uh, oh god, about... there's so much going oh, on now. Oh my god, my eyes hurt watching this. Yeah, me too. I haven't even um, gotten to drink my coffee yet. <laughs> uh, my my partner is a big fan of. Oh god, my eyes are tearing up. Um, Speaking about medical procedures, my partner's a big fan of Grey's Anatomy, um, and I will, like, watch a couple episodes with her yeah. in the background. Um, okay, it's kind of calming. Oh, no, it's not calming down. <laughs> uh, uh, I'll watch a couple episodes with her, and then um, just for poops and giggles, I'll, I'll go onto uh, the Grey's Anatomy subreddit, and then... It's hilarious seeing fans that aren't wrestling fans or anime fans be so upset with how the show is. Why are they upset? There's just like so much vitriol for um, like the, the writing. Oh, okay. Thank God. Uh, so much vitriol for like the current writing staff and like the storylines and like killing. Dude, they kill so many characters off. Is Grey's Anatomy the one where the dog ate a heart? 
I don't remember. Ch- Sorry, Chat don't. will know. The clip was going around recently. Oh, oh, I guess it doesn't do just like a... Continuous. How do you do the continuous? Is that a specific mode? I thought that was... Oh, or is it only with uh, that portion? Oh, uh, I don't know. Um, but we can we can go in and check. Um, see how many... Have to beat the game once. Yeah, I, I've beaten it. I've beaten it plenty of times. Uh, how does it... Sh- or where do you see Orbit? I think it's Orbit. Uh-uh. Huh. Well, um, I mean, these are just my friends. Oh, I think the chat's saying it's per difficulty. Oh, you have to. Okay, so I could do like a normal playthrough. I see. I see. Um, let's bump one of these. I like these effect modes. I never. There was one I was chasing an A on or an S on that I never got. Something that I'm really bad at. Uh, no, let's just do a uh, twin ultra. What's beyond plus master. ultra? Here we go. All right. I was trying to get an A in master. It's. I mean, I'm ultimately trying to get an S in master, but. Right. One Tree Hill was the show where the dog eat the heart. Okay, thank you. <sighs> okay. Good to know. I am going to be able to talk much less in master. Don't worry, I gotcha. <clears throat> okay. What else is going on today? Let me go check whatever loose schedule we got don't going on. Don't look at on. Twitter. Okay. Don't look at Twitter? I mean, I don't know anything, but don't look at oh. Twitter. Oh. Also, I need to put this on the top slot for today. Because otherwise, no one would know. I love how we have just taken this image from Final Fantasy X as the de facto um, we're streaming from home. Was that you? No, that was not me. That that? was a uh, Jeff creation. Of course. The only other one I would accuse of invoking Final Fantasy X. I don't remember Final Fantasy X that well. I remember my little cousin being a big fan of Final Fantasy X2. Um, not the cousin I brought into the office, but a different one. And she insisted on watching the opening cinematic like three or four times before I actually got to start the game. Because she loved the little uh, J-pop bit in the beginning. Isn't that a whole game about J-pop? Oh, yeah. That's the one Final Fantasy that friends of mine who like Final Fantasy and I know that their tastes somewhat align with mine have recommended to me. At least we're going to make it to the drop. Every day I wake up thinking I have make it to the drop. I'm fucked. I'm fucked. A little bit. There you go. Oh. <clears throat> but, uh... oh, starting right after this, yeah. uh, Vincent Caravella and Bradley Shoemaker will be popping off in some satisfactory. I'm going to tune into that. I know nothing about Satisfactory. Uh, it's like Minecraft, right? Kind of. It's like it's like if they, from what I understand, and I could be completely wrong, it's like they took the redstone stuff and ran with it, and then were like, what if we make it more German? Oh. That's, uh, it's, it's a great mentality. Take something and then think, what if I make it more German? <laughs> I like that with food. Okay, that was bad. But 
you know, we still got a little time. I'm gonna do some, uh, just a sampling of some of my favorite levels that I haven't thought about in a while. Yeah, what, what would you say is like top three levels in Tetris uh, effect? Let's see. I would have I have to see them all again. Oh wow! I yeah, on expert I really only got to hear, huh? Ritual oh. Passion uh, is maybe my all time favorite. I'll bump it to normal so I can actually pick some of these later, or see these later ones. Uh, Turtle Dreams I like. The Jellyfish one is really good. Um, Jellyfish is great. Windmills, or Da Vinci, mm -hmm. it's called. Okay, well, you know, let's play Ritual Passion. We'll continue on to Deserted. Maybe we can beat this string of levels. Maybe not. Yeah. Sometimes I have a moment of hesitation that or I was maybe caught up in the arguments and I'm like well maybe Tetris Effect wasn't actually game of the year all those mm -hmm. all those moments are gone I'll never think that again this game rules fantastic God, I, I love I love the look of this this level. You know this must be very awkward, and I I forget if we talked about this yesterday. But um, either applying or starting a new job it must be very weird and awkward right now. Yeah, I mean, lots of offices probably aren't even have to like postpone all interviews and stuff. Right, right. I mean, like, yeah, like, the early parts of uh, job hunting or, like, applying for jobs generally, at least now, is, like, phone screenings, video screenings. Oh, oh shit, it got man. fast. You're making me nervous. Um, but, yeah, good luck, and I, I hope people that are looking for stuff are okay. Yeah, or imagine, like, your first day was supposed to be this coming Monday or something. Oh, Lord. And the office is quarantined. Oh, God. I may have to re-download this later. Yeah, here we go. Yeah, you know, I'm I'm just noticing these people kneeling and like bowing in, in the the background. Are they are they praying to the tes Tetris board? Yeah, they're praying for a line block. One of the earliest. Oh, remember when college humor was like oh, dude. a force yeah. to be reckoned with? Yeah. I remember laughing so fucking hard at the like Tetris God sketch where it was like somebody praying for a line piece or something. I don't even remember. Oh man, uh, college humor was, uh, was Jake and Amir. Yeah, they were they were involved. Wow. Did you ever watch their like prank show where they escalated the pranks on each other? No. It's actually pretty funny. Um, they, my favorite one is like one of the last ones is, uh, you know how some basketball stadiums will do like half court shot for a million dollars. They, uh, one of them, I can't remember who did it to who, let's just say Jake made, set up, like went to the stadium, you know, talked to management, got them to pick a mirror for a blindfolded shot from half court for a million dollars. Uh -huh. And got the crowd to like pop as if he made the shot, even though he was just miles away. Like, 
and everyone's just freaking out, and he's like jumping around, running around, <laughs> oh, and like, oh, it's so good. Uh, I may have to hunt that down later. Okay. Buster Ghost! <laughs> oh god, this started too fast for me. Yeah, it's not gonna get slower, unfortunately. Are these folks making their pilgrimage to the Tetris God? Yeah, it's a, a, a you're kind of it's you start with the Tetris God and work your way back. Um, oh, to show like you know, it's like how Breaking Bad shows both the kind of large scale drug operation, but then also that kind of gets into the like. Here's how it affects the people on the streets. Wow. I'm only thinking of that because I just finished catching up on all of this season of Better Call Saul. Yeah, I'm, I'm thinking of I should just get into a show um, and just, just dive in. I heard Can't Mass Alex just started season three. Holy shit. Mass Alex is is definitely one of the, our series is, is, is that uh, makes me want to replay or play along in a game. Man, Mass Effect Two, what a great game! I love Mass Effect. I even love. Hey, it got slower. I even love Mass Effect Three. I yeah. even liked the original ending to Mass Effect. I mean, I didn't love it, but it was just generic sci-fi bullshit that I was just like, yeah, alright. I guess I had really low expectations. Uh, Jan, here's a question. Which, Do you uh, also want to get into Trails of from Cold Steel? I... One of, one of the last things I did in the office was talk to Michael for a very long time about Trials of Cold Steel. Oh, once you get Heim started on something. Yeah. And I know Ian in the chat was very, very big on it. Um, I mean, I've considered it. I was, like, hovering over the PlayStation Store button. Uh, what I was going to ask is, of all the trilogies you think of and have watched or read or played, which has had the most satisfying ending? Oh, man. So, Back to the Future immediately comes to mind for how unsatisfying it is. I, I was going to say, I, I was going to let you finish your sentence, but I was really ready to be <laughs> like, huh, what? Uh, I, I went to a bar like a month ago and they were playing Back to the Future 3 and then I completely tuned out of my friends when we were hanging out and I was just watching this thinking like, what the fuck? <laughs> what were they thinking? Jules and Vern? I think there's like a... I want to say there's a really weird story of why they ended up as a... why it was a western, but I can't remember uh, off the top of my head. Oh god. Most satisfying trilogies... Let me know if chat has any good suggestions, because I'm trying to think. Like, I like the end of uh, the third Lord of the Rings. Um, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, someone to, someone uh, chimed in with Lord of the Rings. Uh, Toy Story 3, um, but then Toy Story 4 came out. So yeah. it kind of undoes that. But I think, I think you can view those three films as a trilogy, and it's pretty damn good. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um... Leroy Octopus chimes in with Kung Fu Panda, and I, I, yeah, I believe it. I never saw I like the first one. First one's great. Two's even yeah. pretty good. Have I shared with you my million dollar idea that with um, when I used to work at the theater company teaching little children, my director and I were hardcore thinking about trying to write Kung Fu Panda the musical. I'm really and surprised I that hasn't been a thing. I mean, it's perfect. Yeah, dude, kids love it. Shrek the musical wound up doing fairly well. Yeah, but like SpongeBob. Kung Fu Panda. Yeah, it's, dude, SpongeBob the musical is so fucking good. Oh, you know, John Wick one through three, if it stayed as a trilogy, would have been really great. I still haven't seen three. Oh, High School Musical. Uh, that's a trilogy. That's very satisfying. Is, is so three uh, is good. I, I, dude, three is great. Okay, but then again, I'm a very biased source on anything High School Musical. Uh, 
Uh, folks are saying, a person, uh, Max10125, the Bourne movies weren't bad. Uh, yeah, yeah. I, for the life of me, cannot remember. Like, I was, I was trying to think about this the other day. It came up. I can't remember anything that happened in the Bourne Identity movies except that one scene where he fights a guy with a butt wolf. That was, that was really good, yes. I, I remember that Jeremy Renner was there for a hot second. Yeah, I think that okay. was a spinoff. Or was it a spinoff? Um, yeah, a lot of folks are, are... Ian, I don't consider the Xenon trilogy a satisfying trilogy, but Zetus Lapidus, you know? You make my, Ben, you make my heart go boom boom. There were more than one Xenon movies? There's three of them. Holy shit. Are those on Disney Plus? <laughs> uh, I know the first one is. Okay. Uh, ben, you've probably seen that clip of Jeremy Renner singing, right? Yes. Oh, okay. Yes. Have you heard any of his new album? No. He released it around the app, um, and it was just as disastrous. Oh, boy. Imagine God, that. remember the Jeremy Renner app? What a simple time. When anyone could pretend to be Jeremy Renner. Look at these dolphins, dude! Anytime a clear line, they come and fucking pop out of the water. Are dolphins and seagulls friends? Is that something you read from chat? Or? Yes. Oh, okay. Oh, this okay. is good. Uh, people are uh, people are chiming in with uh, Axel Manana. Manana? Oh fuck! The original Ace Attorney trilogy. Yeah, that actually might be number one for me. Uh, the way they resolve the stuff in the third game and tie it back to the first game is actually like I didn't expect it at all and it was just so expertly well done my a sad it was kind of sad but um I was playing that game on a launch DS like my first DS uh -huh. and I um I got all three of them because I it was it was well, it was actually even after like Edgeworth had come out um, okay. when I first started playing them but my DS just died um, halfway through the third game and I was just so distraught and then I ended up just watching the last like half of that oh, game no. on YouTube which is okay because you know those games are practically visual novels anyway sure um, it was still a bummer um, would it upset you Ben if I, I told you I never played any of the Ace Attorney games I think you'd really like them uh, the phone version that came out not too long ago is actually pretty good. Oh, okay. Um, if you're ever looking for something. Uh, I think those games are tremendous. They're funny. They are they have heart. Um, the movie is good, even. The live-action Takeshi Miike Ace hmm. Attorney movie. Better than it has any right to be, and it's basically the plot of the first game. That's cool. Okay. Yeah, yeah. I, I feel like the Ace Attorney trilogy... It came out on Switch, I believe, right? Probably. <clears throat> I still want to play Edgeworth 2. I know there's fan translations out for it. I actually haven't even played the newest Ace Attorney either. Um, ben, a uh, quick question from the chat. i had too lazy to make a poll, but... Best Girl Scout cookie? Samosas, number one. Oh, easy. Thin mints for me. Thin mints are a strong number two for me. Um, I like them, you know, a lot of people will say freeze them. I like them frozen. I like them normal. I think there's no wrong way to eat a thin mint. Uh, I can tell you the worst ones are the shortbread or the mm -hmm. lemon. Have you tried the new s'more one? I did. It was okay. I thought it was okay too, but apparently I'm... A psychopath for thinking it's okay because my partner uh, hates them. Hates them. I think if they yeah. had a little more filling, they'd be a lot better. Yeah, yeah. Uh, all right. Originally, uh, looks like Chad Saint was agreeing with uh, Ben Minson. 
uh, s- Samoas, Samosas, Samoas, Samosas, Samoas. Uh, but then there's a huge outcry of Tagalongs. Which one's the Tagalong? I have no idea. This one's got horsies. Are they in the back? They seem to be on the sides. But I, okay. there might be some in the back. I'm not qualified to answer, though. Oh, tagalongs are peanut butter and chocolate? How come I've never tried this? Oh, yeah, those are pretty good. Um, I don't like the cookie part of them. Uh. But the peanut butter and chocolate is pretty good. I know this is a very hard question, but generally, what do you think your favorite cookie is? Ooh, Oreos. Oreos are like a good chocolate chip. I'm very basic. Do you like a, a, a firm or a chewy? Uh, like a thick one. When you like bend a... it, does it break or does it like crumble kind of? It has to break. Mm. Okay. What about you? I'm uh, chewy all the way. Mm. Uh, unless, well. Oh, thank you, Ian. The thing I needed. Store bought. I might go um, crispy. That's not the right word for them. Um, I'm Sorry. It's okay. That was a nice little distraction. I can't interject with a soundboard on anyone else's stream, so I'm just going to have to play them off a laptop. Give me a line. I kind of want to, I feel like uh, we fucked up by not finishing the EULA, and that's why the game didn't work. Right. I mean, that makes sense. Are you are you going to plug away at the, the EULA and the tutorial to possibly check it out later? Yeah. We'll, we'll talk about it. Yeah, I'm going to play some My Hero 1's Justice 2 at some point. Not necessarily today, maybe today. Who knows? Today's kind of up in the air, which is nice and fun. I, I, yeah. We have a very broad outline of what we want to do, but... Other than the satisfactory stream featuring Vinny and Brad coming up in about 15 minutes or so. I want to play Minecraft. I do, too. Like... I'm... It, like it doesn't have to be a mod or anything fancy just like Did serve not... with all of us we should let's talk after this okay Jan you aren't the first person on staff that has wanted to play Minecraft I, I believe I won't be the last <laughs> uh oh uh, a couple last minute questions from chat before we eventually wrap up this uh, again that murder by numbers pit cross game I think uh, Jeff was talking and he had some interest in that. Yeah, I think a quick look went up this morning. Of that? No, your highness. Went up. Oh, your highness. Uh, I'm, yeah, I'm also interested in, I love Picross. Um, I'm an absolute fiend for the pick. If I knew uh, more about Rick Ross, I'd probably make some sort of joke there. He's a prison guard. Prison guard and owner of a lot of uh, wing stops. Um, Bomber Jan asks, what's the hardest part of the work from home streams from a producer's perspective? Uh, you know, we get a lot of flack for like different qualities from the East Coast and the SF office. Uh, so, you know, it's kind of all across the board, especially with people having different setups at home I canceled a lot of plans this weekend yeah yeah I'm still gonna go fishing on Sunday which should be Ooh. Right. yeah my friend wanted to go fishing for his birthday that sounds like a great time which one of these is fun 
I'm really bad at mystery. Let's let's let it rock. What's mystery? Uh, like random status effects. Oh. Let's see where we're my menu music. Wow, can you hear the PS4 fan? Yeah, I can. It's it's working overtime here. So, I like this oh, level. God. It's fun. Hopefully, this will calm down. Oh man. Okay, so I need uh, to detonate that. Oh, what the fuck? I don't think I ever checked this mode out. The It'll start layering them on top of each other as well. Um, so you'll get like... Just wait till the screen flips, I guess. No. Um, no hold. Mr. Klorosk asks, I'll just abbreviate their question, um, or I'll just outright answer it. Producers have uh, no control over volume settings uh, of the individual streams, unfortunately. No. Um, no, yeah. Other than going to someone's house. <laughs> yeah, I feel like um, yesterday and today were really good tests. Um, yeah, I'm I'm pleased with how well the uh, PS4 streaming works. Yeah, and I'm gonna get some. Uh, I need a new power supply on my computer, I think. Uh, so I might go pick one of those up, and maybe I'll be able to stream from my PC a little easier. Okay. Oh. Okay. Okay. What? Oh, that's cool. Oh, so you diffuse the bomb by making a line through it. Yeah. Uh, Reaper160, the mode Ben is currently playing is mystery. You're not supposed to tell them. Oh. That ruins the mystery. No, that, that it creates more intrigue. Oh. Like Knives Out. Yeah. Yeah. Oh man, I watched Dives Out recently. Shit's good. Shit's good. Uh, I watched a movie that I had no idea what it was. It came out last year and it starred Jesse Eisenberg. Oh, fuck that. Oh, I got so lucky. Um, oh boy. The Art of Self Defense. Oh. Uh, kind of a dark comedy. Okay. I, uh,. Pretty pretty good, especially going in not knowing anything about it. It's on Hulu. 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 Oh hell yeah! Oh what? <laughs> what is this? That's fucked up. That's actually pretty cool. Yeah, these modes are all right. A lot of repetition in some of them, but. These like bottom. <laughs> okay, yeah, here we go. I got two at once now. Oh no. Okay, this didn't seem as bad. Here we go. So, will your pieces fall if that bomb goes off? Uh, no. <laughs> oh. Shit. Who, um,. Who's the band that does the house theme song? Um, why am I thinking Nine Inch Nails? It's not Nine Inch Nails. This reminds me of them. Maybe I'm thinking of someone else. Oh, is it is it these guys? No. 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 Oh. My bad. Ah! Help. I need help. Modest Mouse. Wait, really? Small Assault? 
Uh, oh, I'm, I'm thinking of the XX. Massive attack? Maybe massive attack. Oh, I looked away for a second and then your shit's upside down. Uh, dog, my shit's all the way upside down. Even the score is upside down. Oh yeah, this one, this is so fucked. Fracture, oh, that's messed up. Sometimes these work out, and sometimes it's nice to hold one of them because they're such peculiar shapes that yeah. sometimes one will come in handy for like a teaspoon or something, but actually playing them can be difficult. Yeah. Especially this one, the, the three piece. The, the T piece oh. or whatever. Fucked up. No hold. Oh, that's why I can't bring my line piece out. <sighs> Jan, you want to check with, uh... Folk, since I can't look at Slack, oh my god. On the status of uh, our next stream? Uh, there. Bradley is ready to pick it up, pick it up, pick it up, pick it up as soon as uh, we are done. Great. Uh, this is extra, extra, extra fucked in VR. Oh shit, I didn't even think about that. It must have been so fun coming up with these, like, uh, different. Uh, conditions. Oh, what the fuck? All right, folks, we're we're, we're shutting this down. Easy, easy peasy. Now it's right side up. Pretty messed up that this works. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just gonna have to flip it back over. Oh no! Okay. Ah, uh, dude, this should have been like a Souls game. You shouldn't have been able to pause it. how I used to play Tetris as a kid, sitting this close to the TV, so <laughs> I'm good. You're home. Um, I think this is what the people that pray to the Tetris gods see. <laughs> Seven in a row. Oh, cool. Cool, cool, cool. Three, four, five. There are worse ones to get seven in a row of than the brick. Right. The brick, you can lay a good foundation. <laughs> exactly. It's like bricks. Um, yeah, Y2 Ken asks, uh, what screen is Ben using that he can just turn it around upside down? Uh, I'm playing on my computer monitor right now. Um, uh, okay. A little Asus, just no frills, little monitor. And so now the effects are coming way faster. They reset the speed level, but it's going to get exponentially more fucked up in the coming moments. Yeah.
knocked my French press on the ground. Is it okay? I think it is okay. Oh boy. I'm gonna say you're welcome, chat, for these uh, pro strategies <laughs> to also make you a fantastic Tetris player. Yeah, chat doesn't ever thank us enough for our service. <laughs> New record. Show me a B. Ah! I should get a B for at least ingenuity on that one. Oh, yeah. All right. Well, I think that's going to call it for right now uh, for me. But stay tuned. Um, you might have to refresh the stream. I'm not 100% sure. Uh, uh, they, we... they should be able to just keep this open, I think. Wonderful. Um, great. Well, I, I've had fun playing Tetris. Jan, thank you so much for joining me. I had a great time reading in the beginning of the stream. <laughs> Yeah, I hope that isn't lost to time because that was a lot of fun. Um, stay tuned for some satisfactory with Vinny and Jeff, and then we'll all be back a little later today, probably. Most likely. Um, bye, everyone. Oh, my thing's still upside down. <laughs>